you're watching a Jordan Odega video. Ooh, it makes my day. It makes my little day that at some point in the relatively near future, I don't remember, what's the edit timeline? It makes my future day that you've chosen to come along and watch the video that I'm producing now that the topic is still kind of being chosen. And there is going to probably be a small break in between this opening segment and what we choose to watch. Average put on screen how many minutes it is until we find something interesting and we cut to that. However, thank you so much for coming. If you did want to catch the extremely unfunny portion where I am just Google searching and getting frustrated with myself for being unable to find content to mock mercilessly because I'm unable to produce anything original myself, uh, you can uh, head on over to twitch.tv slash jordanadika. That's me. And you can watch all the unfunny portions that uh, uh, really make you notice how poorly paced these videos and productions are in general, and how much our editor average is responsible for making them even tolerable at all. Cool. Okay, birds of prey. Now I have had my, uh, my, my beady, my beady little uh, eye spies targeted at Alpha M Official. I'm not really sure what it is. I'm guessing it's um, somewhere between tedious and weird through horrendous and despicable, despicable him, because that's just kind of how alpha male and MRA content goes in general. However, let's give him the benefit of the doubt and let's actually check the products real quick. Thank you for the warning. <laughs> TikTok's on my side, but uh, I'm taking the risk. Nose trimmer, a transcendent experience. If you are a, 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 a person that generates in interior nose hair, you have not inhaled correctly in your life. Ooh. Psychological trick, always a good sign, always a great place to start when uh, the advice you're giving to somebody to be their best is deception. <laughs> Other people like you more is to wear blue. Blue, it's like a lot. Oh, thanks for spelling it out. Literally spelling it out. Logically sends the message that you are reliable, that you're trustworthy, and we like people who are reliable and trustworthy. And you just thought it was a coincidence that all politicians rock navy blue. It's not. Because the color navy blue psychologically makes other people feel like they can trust us. Like this, see, this, I, I, this guy is like cocaine flavored ice cream. <laughs> I don't even mind what he's saying right now. I haven't seen any content that, that really upsets me from him, but she... Excuse me, sir. Can I have a moment? You're, I can taste your breath, how close you're standing to me. So I could be broke as fuck, you know? Like, I could, yeah, I, could... I am broke as fuck, but do you see how happy I am? I'm on camera sweating oh, you yeah, up, too. You. I don't know. I don't know why I think this. Is this... Oh, he's literally the be best one. Oh, on that specific street. <laughs> I'm actually the best YouTuber and most popular YouTuber in this chair currently. Oh, it's all this. Okay. After 2 a.m., you. Okay, I'd be down. <laughs> yeah, let's make that happen. <laughs> oh god, there's something you know what? Genuinely, it's even cringier to me when they do kiss. A lean into a stranger where they do kiss you is even more uncomfortable to me. It's, it's something about it is just like, ah, uh, no thanks. Oh my god, I love this dude. How did I forget how funny this guy is? Get out of here, other alphas, okay? Get out, get, get out of here, other pickup artists. When I want to learn how to date someone, also please don't, just a shout out to my partner, no need to watch this portion. Just go, go ahead, skip. Just go ahead, skip this, uh, skip this whole little opening portion. When I'm looking to date somebody, as I often am, I'm not, it's for the bit. <laughs> it's, I'm kidding, I... And we've broken up, okay. When I'm looking to date somebody, the number one thing that I need to keep in mind is, yawn, uh, I need to make sure that I'm the best version of myself I can be, yawn. I need to treat others with mutual respect in order to gain respect, in order to have a fulfilling relationship with a sincere emotional connection. Yawn, I'm basically asleep. Honk shoe, honk shoe, honk shoe. No, what you need to do is just be a bit of a problem. <laughs> That's the best way to really pick people up, is to just kind of be very lightly abrasive. Be like chafing underwear in a social setting. Let's let's lean in, see what we, we have to learn. Okay. <laughs> now we don't know for sure that he has an eight pack, so we can make fun of him. You know the rule, we don't make fun of anybody that's uh, shredded to the point where they have more abs than I have friends. However, we don't know that for sure, but we do know that his triceps have an area coach. Jesus. It's olive oil and feta cheese or whatever. <laughs> <laughs> feta <Right>? cheese. <laughs> Isn't that good I'm for your skin? Never a big fan of when the setting for a video is uh, <laughs> trying to pick up or engage on an inappropriate level with somebody that is professionally forced to talk to you. That never feels like a 
Oh, it quite feels like a full swish, huh? Oh my god, he's wearing blue. He's wearing blue and that means he's definitely not threatening. <laughs> Him and his other bulldog friend surrounding a three foot five woman. Strip with that, just... Let me see it. There's a couple porn stars on there, huh? Thank god we work our own business. Can you imagine going to work and you accidentally, oh, like, forgotten? I interviewed her last time. Who is she? He loves that one. Who? Remember this one? Time cap. Oh, Jesus Christ. Come on. <laughs> the reason I've lasted this long is actually probably because he's wearing blue. Oh, she has no ass. There's, there's she literally has no ass. Oh, wait. The answer is no. He is asking a question. Picking up bottle service, girl? I, 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 I mean, I'm not sure, honestly. Probably not. It's probably not doing that. Anyway, peace and love. Loving the blue. I see somebody's seen that video reply brackets the one by testosterone jones or whatever his name was. <laughs> am i close we interviewed her <laughs> <laughs> this guy's such a savage hey th i may not be able to read social cues all that well but the one thing i know for sure is that this this color means that i'm unthreatened being surrounded by a collective 450 total pounds of muscle mass which are also much taller than you results in comfort. The color blue has given her a feeling of safety. That's what she's feeling right now. <laughs> we've had, I mean, we've had the video. Usually there's a couple reasons for that. Number one. Hmm, number one. Hmm, what could it be? <laughs> she's not interested, but feels that by saying that, you would pose a threat in some way. No, that can't be right. It must be a, 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 a mind game that requires that you, I don't know, uh, do a push-up. It's just the situation. She's not in the right mental state. She okay, okay, well, that's one of the multiple possible options. What's the other one? Is it the th exact thing that I said, probably, maybe? Busy, she... She's busy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, somebody you're attracted to and interested in dating comes up to you and is like, hey, do you want to just kiss, kiss for kid? Do you want to be somebody that does kissing with me, perhaps, from time to time? The name's Testosterone Timmy. I would love to say yes, uh, but it's bloody tax season. So check back in next week or after 5 p.m. Would that work? What do you mean? Because she's bi you were just chatting up somebody that was uh, <laughs> working at work. You encircled a woman at work. You know, maybe late for work, and, or it could just be her default response. She's done it so many times that, you know, she's not in a place or time where she- Why did she do it all those other times, you think? Why do you think that was her response the other time she did it? I'm a natural skeptic, and I do apologize for this, because I'm now realizing that I just have a very negative mindset. Uh, it, it's not about drive, it's not about power for me. Clearly, like, whenever somebody is not been attracted to me or interested in dating me, it's just timing. <laughs> it's probably the lighting at the time, uh, or the season. Mm. <laughs> Nobody dates in the fall. Girl will tell you she has a boyfriend right away, and it could be a lot of different reasons. She could be telling the truth, or she could be lying. <laughs> she could be telling the truth, I guess. Or she could be lying, because she definitely is, and there's several reasons for that. Uh, naturally genetically deceptive. <laughs> Foolish and not as intelligent. No testosterone to make them strong and cool like me. Oh no. <laughs> oh no. Really? Why is he still advertising it? What are you talking about? Was he throwing shade at my guy? Does he not know about his eight abs, maybe? Probably? Uh, I've had a guy take a girl on a five hour hike. I was like, did you close? He's like, okay, well, so I just, as something of an alpha male, I know that if you go on a, to a location and do a hobby with a woman, they at least owe you affection, right? Legally, so what, it, what happened? Like, nah, it's just kind of tired. I'm like, <laughs> this just doesn't make any sense. But the rules, <laughs> but what about the rules? She has to date you. Do you really want to close a girl who's been hiking for five hours? I mean, that's kind of, it's kind of spicy. A part of this is playing into the age-old motivated idea that women fundamentally don't like sex, or at least don't like it as much as men. Not true, it's not even a little bit true, literally. It's just like literally not the case. Plays into that idea that men are just like inherently predatory. That's the game. The misogynistic idea that they must be, they must be the property. They must be pursued. That's what, that's what dynamics are. Men are a, a dangerous wolf and the women are prey. But they are not part of the fucking wolf pack, I tell you what. They do not get their wings, kid, all right? All of you in the chat, all of you watching, you get to join us. No alphas, no self-purported alpha males. In the wolf pack, everyone is an alpha. We fly in a perfect A shape. 
across the moonlit night. Feel like you know what I mean? It's kind of like you're causing the initial conditions. Ooh, definitely too long. We've hit that. I'm proud of myself for hitting uh, five zero on that one. Which girl? Which girl? What are the subgenres? Horror, action, first person shooter. He's right, in a girl. And you're gonna have to get exposed to different levels of. Levels? New Game Plus. <laughs> I like a girl who's into education, but like not book smart, but like not street smart. Like. Not book smart or street smart. But into edu- I mean, like works in the education industry. <laughs> what are you talking about? <laughs> I don't even really want to endorse this idea that you have to uh, set very clear specs, like like listing your PC specs for a, a woman that are deemed acceptable. But at the same time, hey, what are you? What? Hmm? Sorry, let me just affect my alpha male voice. <clears throat> there are seven billion people on the planet. Watch and find out why you need to date around and figure out what qualities you like. Flirt dating pick. What happens if we click flirt? <sighs> Depressing. Depressing as always. Oh, this is great. You know, a good sign, what I always love to see, a bit of categorization. That's that's always a good thing to do with any group of people, is to sort them into uh, collective buckets that you can then assess their value with. Hilarious. <laughs> Hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> That's not a good sign, is it? That nationality is one of them. Every time I meet an Australian girl in Vegas, first question, do you guys have any coke? And I'm like, no. Here are random facts and observations I have come to with. Okay, now what are we guessing as one of the options here? Because I, I don't imagine it's all just like, Australian girls. Oh no, what's going on? No, 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 no. The witness over the past 30,000 approaches. The best girls to meet in a Vegas club are hands down Canadian girls. They're nice, they're friendly, they're down to party and- They have to wear the flag so you know where they are. <laughs> they're attractive. When a girl says, I'll see you later, what she means is, I won't see you later. Or well, she means that uh, she will. And that's, that's, uh, but that's the rule. Remember that when somebody says something, they almost never mean it if they're a woman, I guess, is the rule. If a woman says something by default, they're lying kind of seems like the rhetoric of, the, of these types of videos. LA Korean girls, probably hands down the most, the meanest creatures you will ever meet on this planet. <laughs> this feels like projecting, right? LA Korean girls, like, like, fucking Samantha. <laughs> Avoid her, she'll break your freaking heart. They're very entitled. If they don't know you, they will rip your asshole apart. Oh, uh, that's a very, 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 very specific reference. Will they do that? Yeah, they're pretty good. Told you. No, don't kiss me, okay? Don't fucking think I break, bitch. Oh yeah, my hands are- You're probably gonna end up going home, crying in a corner, uh, wetting yourself, okay? <laughs> But not me. <laughs> I would never do that, and I haven't, actually. And I, I oh, I need to change. <laughs> I'm an alpha, though. If you are a coach, if this is your industry, if this is your, if this is your game, you should lose your license if the interaction you have is ever, hey, you've ripped my ass all apart. You just like, fuck LA Korean girls. Like, the moment that happens, if a Lyft driver just takes a big dump on the back seat, you don't get to keep doing it. If a doctor drops the scalpel down into your stomach during surgery, you don't get to just keep doing surgery, I don't think. If you just accidentally get in an active, almost physical confrontation with a woman that you were trying to pick up and then you blame it on <laughs> where they live and their race. <laughs> You don't get to do this anymore. Gamer girl. Ew, why would you want to? Ew. This is random, but I thought you were cute and I had to come talk to you. Oh, hi. Um, I like gaming, so I like playing video games here. Ew. Oh, wow, that's really interesting. Um, are you familiar with gaming? It's actually about ethics and games journalism. I used to a lot. Oh, for real? Like, yeah, I used to like, I really want to get back into streaming because like... A streamer, you say? <laughs> I mean, I wasn't really feeling it, but uh, what emotes do you have available? <laughs> can I, um, can I actually hit you with a something of a tier two? <laughs> I'm being maced. <sighs> okay, uh, I have spectacular news. I have wonderful news for each and every one of you. The video is over. We are done with this challenging and emotionally exhausting period of our life. And the next thing we're going to do is just take a deep breath. Remember that Alpha M, uh, uh, Stephen, uh, Stephen, Penis haver, or whatever the channel is called. He's not really here. We're not actually surrounded by 
two men using just the most pl flaccid and unengaging conversation starters imaginable. We're actually just here together. Look, he's behind you! My heart is focused on Bob Cuts and Adderall long cuts and retakes. All right, this meme that I am the human embodiment of mint chocolate chip ice cream has got to die. You get to choose whether or not you call me Johnny Content or mint chocolate chip uh, uh, sweet child. That's all you get. Okay, it's the choice. You don't get to dabble, you don't get to have your mint chocolate chip ice cream and eat it, if you will. We choose choc- don't choose- choose Johnny content. <laughs> Wait, <laughs> I didn't want it to be the choice, actually, though.